Coming up next, it's a UFC light heavyweight division encounter. You know, we trot out the term well-rounded in modern day mixed martial arts, maybe more than we should, but this guy fits the bill. Maybe doesn't stand out in any one area on film, but plus skills everywhere. And you gotta think tonight, Joe, with his skill set, he's more than comfortable really anywhere this fight goes. If he needs to stand and strike, he can do it. If the fight hits the canvas, he can submit you. A lot of different skills brought to the table by this young man. This guy is extremely well-rounded. His submissions are world-class. His striking is excellent. And he is extremely unpredictable in what attack he chooses to go with. All right, so here is the boxer making the walk for his UFC debut. You'd be hard-pressed to find guys in the UFC right now that bring this much boxing skill to the table. Not just power, but the speed to go with it. He'll wow you with his combinations. He attacks the body with a plum. A lot of different skills brought to the table, but the boxing certainly is what jumps out of the film room. We'll see if he can get the ability going here tonight in his UFC debut. This guy is primarily a boxer, and though he has a well-rounded skill set, he prefers to use his excellent boxing technique to get the victory. for this light heavyweight tilt. More than a decade separates these two fighters when it comes to the age, with similar height and some differences in reach. All right, now for the particulars, here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Bergliata. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Toyota Center in Houston, Texas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC light heavyweight division. Introduce the first. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding really professional record on. 18 wins, 9 losses. He stands 62 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Tempe, Arizona. She be the Tobin Run And now, introducing his opponent. This man is a boxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, Dana Fly. All right, group of losing in the locker room. I want you to bring my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. Want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, back your corners. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in, because it's about to go down right now. And we are ready to go with live action from Toyota Center here in Houston, Texas. Oh, good hard kick. kick gets through. That one hurt. Some of the best kicks in the game that you'll see right there. And he's gonna try to take the back. Now he's in half guard. He's got it. Full mount. Nice shot to the head. Hip escape. Gets out of the full mount. Mount again. Well, as usual, suffocating work from the top here by Dana White. He's in half guard. He's working from full mount again. And he connects with the punch. Keeps the elbow there. 
Half guard here. Now he gets the full mount again. Elbow lands for him. He hip escapes to the full mount. Trying to pass here. In the full guard here. Guillotine. He's got the choke. This is, could be it. That guillotine is stunning. And, that stunning. Do it. and he really made it look easy. He got choked, didn't tap in time, and went out. Yeah, Joe, I'm not sure if I'm most impressed with the setup or ultimately the technique to finish off the choke there, but his opponent showing off his patented toughness wasn't willing to tap, so ultimately he goes to sleep. A huge result that we are just digesting here tonight. And so let's look at it again from another angle. He doesn't even get a chance to tap. And one last time, excellent technique on that choke for the submission victory. So there he is, your winner by submission, and that's exactly how you put the rest of this division on notice. Looks like this guy could be a factor moving forward in this division. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at 2 minutes, 41 seconds of the very first round. For the winner by submission, CB, the Doberman Barrowland! So there he is, your winner by way of submission. And candidly, Joe, I'm not sure this night could have gone any better. He did have some doubters coming in. He said, I got to mute those naysayers. And they're not going to keep quiet unless I can actually get this guy out of there. So mission accomplished. No judges necessary tonight. He gets the submission. And now all that's left is to celebrate with his coaches and training partners. What a moment for this oncoming fighter here tonight.